Good to go. There we go. Okay. Ow. Pop my neck. Was not trying to do that. What do I have notification for? Ah, yeah. Okie dokie. Um, this is... Okay. Here we go, let's get this show on the road. So, my opponent has uh, full cleared me. However, um, he didn't do so prettily, which is fine by me. Um, he did drop on Tarkin. Yeah. Cleared anything else, you know, it's fleets for you. Fun times to be had. And then down south, um, he dropped. But let me show you something that he did last night so last night uh he two shot java but then i saw he'd gotten four more points from 54 to 58 and wondered how apparently he didn't kill this entire darth malgus team in one shot so that must have been annoying but then he two shot everything else down here which is fine by me so R9 Kit Fisto here. Has the same GLs as I do, so no ray to be had. I don't have to worry about that today. Uh, there's his R9 Kit Fisto. He's got a broken Qui-Gon team, so I don't have to worry about the speed boost from Cam. Radis, Vader, and Jabba. And he's got Reva down here with uh, Vader, so that's something. Luckily, neither one of these Datacrons on the two GLs up here have defense. So, that's a good thing. Um... You know, still dealing with uh, Lord Vader and Jabba that are high relic, especially uh, he has the setup for the four man of the crate raid for Jabba. Hey, Noah and Rusty, how are y'all? And then down south, we got Bastila, led JML team, Gas, Starkiller, and then a Malgus. And I have not made up my mind on what I want to do yet with the Bastila team because. I just haven't yet. Um, okay, we might just do that. Okay. Um, but yeah, loads of GLs to deal with. Well, three. So half of his GLs are on defense, and you know, I know he has um, the Jedi Knight Cal Rex all done. So I think those are in the back, if I remember correctly. Looking at his defenses, but um, yeah. Let me get this turned on over here. And yeah, we'll just uh, get rocking and rolling here. Um, We're going to knock out um, Vader, hopefully. Um, With Kylo, is the hope. You know, protection, health, stats, debuff the spell on Vader himself, so... No, that's good, Noah. Well, at least you got... At least you will be getting, um... Executor. <laughs> hey, the good thing is, is that you won, Jason. Uh, you know. Even though you had mods missing, you still managed to make it work. So that is all that matters, honestly. You know? Okay, uh... Take this, a little bit of defense, crit damage, and health protection will help some. And the good thing is I can use my Treya wherever I need her, because without a rabbit team to kill, this won't be as big of a problem as it normally would be, so. Yeah, hopefully everyone's having a good Monday so far. Okay, let's click on his head. Thank you, game. Alright, we're gonna... Poke her in the face. Give that to Daka. That's fine. Cleanse off the debuffs. 
Well, I guess we can go back to Reva now because she's taunting again. Smack her in the face. Cleanse more debuffs. See if we can land some stuns. Nope. No stuns at all. Um, poke again. And we can cleanse in a second. Or not. Or not. Um, well, that's annoying. Okay, let's get rid of those debuffs. And now we can go into ults in a second. Why run Vader without Royal Guard? I have no clue. Well, I know why, because um, he's doing this lineup to hopefully trip up people that use Kylo against him. Um, the problem at is without Royal Guard. You know, I mean, you can do well with Ninth Sister, don't get me wrong, but it's just, you know, Royal Guard is really, you know, there to be Vader's main uh, source of protection. Oh, well, Walt's not coming back now. That's annoying. But, um, yeah, I have no idea why he didn't do Royal Guard. Um, he can't really do Royal Guard anywhere else with anyone because, well, he has Palpatine with Starkiller on defense. So that's kind of like, uh... Oh, that's annoying. Why is this? Yeah, healing mini on everyone. That's problematic, to say the least. Especially with Vader about to be an ult again. I mean, GI isn't a bad choice necessarily to run with Lord Vader. It's just, I do agree, Royal Guard would have been a better pick, per se. It's just, I don't really know why he picked this specific lineup kind of deal, you know? Um, if you have, uh, I mean, six dot dots would be good. Six dot, no, six dot mods would be good to have on all of them just to have them. But, uh, yeah. Okay. Well, that just completely threw all of my plans out of the, uh, out of sync here. Um, well, if Vader hadn't kept fucking healing everyone up, Maul would have been dead, GI would have been dead, everyone would have been dead except for Vader, but no fucking no. No, fuck you, GL, I'm not clipping that shit. Absolutely not, I'm not clipping that, that is embarrassing as hell. Hell no. God fucking damn it. Uh, I fucking hate this game. Because now I'm going to lose. So that's great. Um, great. What the hell am I going to do now? Um, does now I have to, like, two or three shot that? This doesn't have to be two shot. Um. Oh, wait, no, I... Oh, never mind, never mind, never mind. It does, but the problem is, is, is I don't like to have to worry about Wiggle Room. I would just prefer to not have to worry about being in the predicament I am. God damn it, Vader. Fucking hell. Just... Ah, I fucking hate this game. Um, what the hell was I doing here? Thrawn. Royal Guard. Um, I'll take... Uh, where did he go? Uh, this boy. I had all this thought out and all that shit, and then just, nope. Maul had to ruin the day. Of course. Go figure. Well, this will be fun. So, anyways. Okay. Jump. 
no point in doing the debuff this the debuffs all over the place because he's gonna cleanse it obviously uh fracture you so you can't do diddly shit speaking of fracture we're just gonna kill you now or not that's cool very cool hi necron how you doing man Awesome. No more of that bull crap from her. So pissed right now. So pissed. Let's see, can we kill Boba Fett? I hope we can. Let's see. Big jump. I think we're... Yeah, I don't know if I'll be able to kill Boba. Actually, I might be able to with Maul in a second. Or not. That's cool. Okay, he's still taunting. Can we kill him with an AoE? We can! Awesome. No more Boba Fett. He's not the fat Boba, but you know what I mean. But yes, Jam, I will clip it later on. I just... Oh my god. <laughs> uh, man. I have no words. Let's see, do more of that. Another leap. The good thing is... Well, that's not bad, Necron. I mean, considering he's double your GP, that's pretty, pretty good. That's a good trade-off. One loss, and there's only a guy double your GP. There you go. This is the way. Okay. Come on, game. Let me kill Imbo. There we go. Uh, shoot, shoot him in the face. Another jump. And then... We can ult. The only problem is it's R9 for Sanson, so he has an absolute metric butt ton of health protection. Oh, oh, it's because of his uh, unique. Never mind. Okay, there we go. Now he's just. Thom, I swear to god, I hope he doesn't eat anyone. But you'll probably eat Maul, let's be honest. Yep. <laughs> Maul. <laughs> Maul. <laughs> of course it was Maul. Hey, Executor is worthwhile. Don't don't skip it. Yeah, I did jinx it that time. But it seems like Jabba always is aimed at uh, either Cat or uh, Maul. doesn't really matter who... Using against him, he always goes for the one person you don't want dead, so. Yeah. Can you please die, you fat slug? Die! Die! No, that's recovering protection. I don't want you doing that. Okay, we're taking this shit off of auto. Okay. Bye-bye, Jabba. Awesome. Well, there's one GL down. Now I'm going to have to think up what I'm going to do against the Vader, though. This is going to be the problem. He is preloaded. It's an R9 with Reva and GI. Um, piss. The thing is, I need something for Bastila Sean and uh, JML down here. 
So I also have gas to contend with. I have Star Killer. I have Malgus. I have all sorts of garbage to deal with today. Um. Yeah, I could try bounty hunters. The only problem is, is I worry about uh not being able to kill anyone with them. I mean, the good thing is there's no Thrawn, so it could work. The other problem is I don't remember if GI had done his lightsaber throw or not. So, um, yeah, I'm just trying to think. Um, um, what to do? What to do? What to do? Oh, ow. Just popped my shoulder. Let's see here. Skywalker. Oh, I could try that out, but I'll wait until do that. Okay, um. Hmm. Okay. Oh. Oh. Yeah, I can agree with you there, with Jason. Um, if anyone had told me I'd have my bounty hunters worked on years ago, I'd have been like, what are you talking about? Hmm. <laughs> okay. Um, I don't know what I want to do now. I'm so... I'm th so, thrown in such a loop right now because... Um, yeah, but if I bounty hunters them, I won't have, uh, Mando and Grief to run against Vader if I end up doing that. So I might as well try Vader, or I can JMK it, because, I don't know, we'll try bounty hunters. We'll see how this goes. Um... I know I need Man Bam. Where is he? Um, do we take Bosker Zam? Yeah, no, he's one of the nine people globally that has an R9 kit pistol. Probably four platoons. I don't know, really. It's not... <laughs> I have no idea. Uh, okay. We'll take this. I mean, the debuff... Not the, the defense is what I'm really looking at there. So, alright. Let's go see how quickly this can blow up in my face. <laughs> um, uh, damn. Um, okay, we got Maul out. That's good. Okay, that's annoying. Now let's kill GI. There we go. New Kareva. Awesome. Okay. There we go. <laughs> this is a lot better than it was about five seconds ago. <laughs> Cleanse again. Taunt again. 
Uh, uh, ah, I meant to armor shred that. Whoopsie daisies. Not what I meant to do. Let's cleanse. Not cleanse, that's a swarm. Whatever. You know what I mean. Swarm again. Bounty Hunter is better than SLKR confirmed. God damn it, Tom. Okay, let's kill her off. Uh, let's see what Vader does here. Because not being able to cleanse is going to be the problem. Um, that's going to be the problem. Okay, let's keep Finnick alive. Mando's done his bit. He got rid of Reva for me. Cleanse again. Probably should have just kicked, really, but we'll do that in a second. Swarm. <laughs> yeah, try killing him while he's in damage me. That makes sense, Vader. Okay. Call Fennec again. Kick. More kicks, more kicks. Cleanse again. More kicks. There we go. Oh god, okay. That's so stupid that that's <laughs> Maul man. Maul Ugh, Maul makes me mad. Okay. We got those knocked out. Those saves me GLs for down south because I will need GLs down here. Um first and foremost, we're gonna take out this stupid team. Yep, it's time for Malgus. However, Malgus this time does not have defense. And I did change my defenses. I took off um, my Sith Empire Trooper. So I do have Sith to run with him. So, we'll have some bodies for him to hide behind. <laughs> as well as, like, armor, obviously. But, uh, you know. Yeah. Uh, let's see. We'll take these. Unless I want another tank. Uh... Yeah, Qui-Gon is uh, very good at causing issues on defense, I'm not going to lie. I have a no follow-up for that. Um, he's just an annoying pain in the pain in the ass to deal with, honestly. Um, um, yeah, we'll leave it like this. Alright. Nice. Uh, we take another tank. Probably should. We'll take another one, just to hide... Um, my armor behind. Alright, um, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna link Ravon. Just gonna go ahead and give him. Dax of best car because if I don't, then she's never gonna get turned again to do so. <laughs> so yeah, just gonna do it now, kind of thing. And then if I really need more best car, we can deal with that later, kind of thing. But I'm kind of doubting I'll be able to get more best car out. So it is what it is. I'll take two stacks. Um, throw some lightning at him. If she, if they could kill my, that that'd be absolutely spectacular. Okay, or just kill, uh, assassin. <laughs> um, god damn. Okay, we can ult. Yeah, I'd be interested to hear or know what. Uh, well, there goes armor. Whatever. Um, be interested to know what your Qui-Gon pulled, because if you held three times, that's definitely the worthwhile investment of that army. I mean, his army's worthwhile regardless. It's just, I personally haven't gotten around to working on my Jedi, because I am working on Ray shenanigans, you know? So. Oh, you run GK with him. Ooh. Hmm, that's a possibility then. Especially if he just didn't get uh, around GK. Does he have... He does not. Okay, let's get... There we go. Now he can't heal, but I need to take a turn. 
So we can do this. Okay, Marauder survived. Okay. You might want to get Padme, though. Padme is really good. Alright. Now for the Bastille of Kron, I believe there's defense on this one. Yeah, 122%. Uh, it's not the best middle roll to hold debuff to spell, and it's only her, so it's kind of like, okay. Um, I am going to JMK this, just because... Yeah. Like, my options were I would either JMK the... Uh, Malgus team, or I was going to JMK this. The problem was, since I had used um, Watt with my Kylo that failed earlier, I really didn't have a, you know, didn't really have Watt to run. Yeah, I could have done an SLKR solo on this, but uh, I figured he would have been enough to deal with the stupid Vader. Lord Vader up north, but um, obviously I was proven wrong, so uh, yippee for me. <laughs> We're gonna mini ult and then kill uh, Jedi Luke over here. Why couldn't CLS would? Okay, CLS. I looked at the win ratio on dot GG. It's like a sixty something percent win ratio, so it's not the worst, but it's also not the best, and with my CLS being lower relic than most of all of his team, I really wasn't um, winning the risk of that kind of a endeavor. Alright, bye bye Luke. Now for that. Oh. I mean, um, I'm not doubting you, but I'm just like, with my I, okay, so my highest relic is a uh, character for that team is um, Han because of the uh, requirements for whatever relic. Oh, for Jabba. Like I had to think about it for a second. Like who was he relicate for again? Yeah. I just yeah. I, I mean, I could have, but especially after that fail. <laughs> Against Lord Vader, I don't really want to take a whole lot of risk. I mean, I'm going to be taking a risk anyways in a second. So, yeah. Yes, it is the Bastille Kron. However, it's not the good one, uh, Jam. It has to debuff the spell on the level 6 roll. It has a good chunk of defense. However... It's not the good fast look on. Alright, let's start ramping up some more damage here, boys. Let's kill her. Uh, him, sorry. Watt, my bad. Now I'll go for Bastila. Really need to get Hoda out of stealth. Let's kill her, maybe? Nope. Well, have fun. Hopefully it's not too hot wherever you are, because... Yeah. Nah. <laughs> it's too damn hot. I really need to get him killed before he goes back into stealth here. There we go. Alright. I mean, yeah, it is a distinct possibility. So. Let's see how long this goes, because... Yeah. A 250% defense Gron. That's better than my best one, man.
Why would it pulse that early on? Like, it looks like I almost get through the max protection, or bonus protection, and then it just, he recoups it, like, immediately. It's kind of like, well, that's rude. There we go. Got through the bonus protection, finally. Man, I don't know how y'all got all these high defense crons, but y'all are some lucky SOBs. Because I sure as hell didn't. Like, my highest one is that one I have on my Darth Malgus team. That got a little too close for comfort, though. <laughs> um, uh, that was way too close for comfort. 100... Is that supposed to be 100%? I have no idea what the... I can't really tell what the second portion of that Hellsteel thing is supposed to be. I'm going to grab the bonus energy before I forget about it. No, I don't want that. Okay. Now I can go back. 100%. Okay. Nice. Still worth it. Still worth it. Okay. Alright. So, for sky, for gas, I'm going to have to probably try to, uh, uh, CLS it. Because I don't have, um, a whole lot much else to run against it. Beats almost all Java teams. Good lord. Or, I mean, okay, so, we'll be better here. Should I just... Should I, um... CLS this or JML it? Yeah, I ran crew with um my Omni Seer, but uh I switched out the tanks. I put a ninth sister in and I have a crew team in the back. Uh Star Kill is on defense. Yeah. He uh managed to pull two teams. Or one team and then he had a he's the second team, so yeah. I don't know what he used against my Star Killer, but whatever it was, it did not work for him. Um, let's see. Oh, why is he on defense? Um, I'll have to look that up, Michael. Um, but Tyler, the reason why Starkiller is on defense is just because he just is. I don't really have a good answer for that. Um, I really have to be, I don't know, finicky with what I do for my defenses, so... Come on. Hey. If you're able to spend that kind of money on the game, you do you, man. I may bash whales, but like, they, you guys keep the lights on, so <laughs> I can't really be too god-awfully upset that y'all spend that kind of money on this game. Like, trust me, the whales are definitely, you guys definitely pull your weight on keeping this game uh, funded, so I can't really, can't really knock it. Alright, let's see. 
Okay. I'll steal. Okay. Um. Pretty sure this will work, but let me check real quick. Oh yeah, this, this should be fine. Okay, we're gonna do some old Inquisitorious fun here with Reva. Hey, 25k might not be a lot for some people, you know. Just depends on... Just depends on what you've spent it on. So... Um, yeah, okay. Alrighty. Thank you, Bears, for marking yourself for death. I appreciate it. Now for you, Mara Jade. Probably should kill... <laughs> I was going to say I probably should kill Vesis, but um, never mind. 195th in the globe. Wow, that's... Way better than me, obviously. Me, some Kyber too. Uh, yeah. Okay, so Afra, Seer, and Swordy are back here. Okay, so he didn't change anything like I thought. This is gonna be a problem though. What am I gonna do against Afra? What is this Seer team? It's not even a proper Seer team. Why did you not put Jedi Knight Cal out front with Bastila and Jedi Master Luke? What the hell? Okay. Oh god, what am I gonna do against her? Oh wait, um... Yeah, I can just do this. GG is on defense, unfortunately. I, like I said, I made some changes to my defense, and Grievous went down on defense, so, uh, who did I pull off? Oh, so that my mall team could come off. If I can use my set with, um, with, uh, C earlier. I'm trying to remember who I used him with. I'm like, What's the cron on this? Oh, dots. Okay. Alright. Where do I need range for anything? No, we'll, we'll take shore. Storm, shore, storm, whatever. Whatever tank it is, I just clicked on. Oh, my neck hurts. Alright. Let's get her stunned, I hope. Beautiful. Uh, let's do that. Let's do a little bit of that. A little bit of that. A little bit of this. <laughs> yeah. I mean, okay, here's the thing. I'm going to bad batch that seer team, but this also the good thing is it's a busted. It's not a properly like set up seer team because with Jedi Knight Cal, it, they don't get as many bonuses. Also, I think you have to have all. Let me look at this. I can't remember what the army is. If all allies are dark side, or on the light side, online forces are no clock. Like, yeah, it, they he broke his army on this, so he wasted. <laughs> An army on this setup because he threw in Jedi Knight Cal because Jedi Knight Cal is a Jedi. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I mean, I, I don't know what he was really thinking here. Damage immunity. Hell, well, that's a lot of health steal though. Good lord. My only worry is will be how this fight will go. I just, I just worry. I'm just worried about it. I'm not going to lie. Um, so, yeah. Um, 
Well, the crit damage would be nice, so I guess we'll go with this. Yeah, we'll go with crit damage. But yeah, like, I, I don't know why he thought Jedi Knight Cal would be a good choice for this. So. Also, this is my first time fighting a Jedi Knight Cal, so. Woohoo! This will be interesting to see how things go. Alright, we got a little twisty twisty there. Um, we're gonna go for OG Cal here because I actually probably should kill Fulcrum before she does anything stupid. Like nuke people. <laughs> okay, there's a damage unity on her. Um, let's do a little bit of this. Uh, uh, buff the spell in. A little bit more buff the spell in. Okay, they're in damage immunity. Uh, Aphra's on defense still, so. For Sorty, I have. I'm not really sure what I'm going to do against Sorty, honestly. I haven't made up my mind. So, we'll figure it out in a second. Because I also still gotta figure out what I'm gonna do against Abrad and, um... What was the other team up north? I don't remember now. Um, I also don't remember what the other team up north was. Um, I have to look. I don't remember. Um, I have JML still, so I mean, you know. Can you please just die? My guy? Like... Fine, we'll just kill Brew. Or not. <laughs> or just not. Die! Thank you! Yeah. Gas is on defense. CLS is already used. Um, also, there's no Zeta on her leadership, so that makes things a little easier. Is it her leadership I need to worry about with the Zeta? Oh yeah, she gains 10 speed. Well, eh, and droid parts. So, without the droid parts, it seems a little easier to handle. So. Alright, um, oh, Qui-Gon, that was the other team. So, hmm, what are we going to do against Sorty? I probably could just Wampa this. Um... You know what? Nah, we're not gonna. Mm, well, no, we're not gonna take the risk. Um, what is Overkiller? Uh, Michael, my Wampa is a relic. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Oh, health steel and protection and health, or. HK and Droidica. Okay, then. I'm just gonna overkill with this, because then I can do, uh... I should be able to do my Jedi Knight Revan team against, um... Abrad. And then I can, uh, JML the, um... Qui-Gon. Sorry, I can't... I can't... I'm trying to keep track of everything all at once. <coughs> Uh, cooldown increase. Uh, give it to him. Gotta go for. Yeah, I'm probably gonna do. Well, I mean, the thing is, if I don't take Hoda in with um my um Jedi Revan team, won't be as good per se. But I mean, yeah, we'll we'll figure it out in a second. I'm kind of a little bit more at ease with how things have gone now, especially after that, after the way it all started. So, you know. Oh, what the hell? I, what? Okay, I wasn't expecting that to work on Sorty because she wasn't below 50% health. Oh, I wasn't going to JML solo. I was going to take JML with some Jedi. Don't, don't worry, I wasn't going to solo it. Nah, <laughs> I'm not that crazy yet. I haven't lost my marbles. Well, I have, let's be honest, but not to that extent. 
All right, what is the Kron on this team, though? I haven't looked at it. Oh, bonus health protection and offense, health steal, and extra protection on top of everything else. So, okay, um, Jedi Knight Revan. Revan. Uh, those guys will take my Bastila Kron. And then, uh, yeah. Let's go kill us some rebel scum! Do a little leap there. Do a little twirl there. Do a little buff spreading. Eventually. Hopefully. Thank you. Call you to assist again. Do another jump. That's a lot of exposes. Like, that's a ridiculous... Uh... Ouch. Um, like I said, it's a lot of exposes. <laughs> Oh, and now he has no marked on him. Lovely. Great, now we gotta get through to that again. Okay. Um. What is that? Cup solo the GI Kron. Oh my god. Man, you are one crazy fool. I am not gonna. Uh, also, my cup is like low, low, low gear. What the fuck is this shit? He's recovered all that protection I got rid of. Can you please die, Radis? For the love of Christ. No. There we go. Fuck you. Bastard. I need to get the gin, is the problem. There we go. Also, this mad lad has Jin's territory were on me. I would like to point that out. Because whenever I was looking at his account last night, I'm like, what the hell kind of stuff is all this? Like He has some odd Odd, uh, army selections. I mean, I do as well, but, like... Yeah. Man, Necron, I don't know what kind of magic juice you gave yours, but, like... Is her army worth it? Well, it's territory of war. It gives them extra speed and such, but... Um, I'd have to look at what all it does. Let me look real quick while this goes on. Jins. I mean, okay, so Jin's army, it gives a uh, Rogue One allies 30% max health and 30% extra potency and 20 speed. Uh, whenever an ally expire, an ally buff expires on a Rogue One ally during an enemy's turn, Jin gains 10% TM. Which is nice, because if you're buffed to spelling, you're going to give them TM. Uh, if all allies are Rogue One at the start of battle, whenever she crit hits an enemy, all allies recover 10% health and gain additional bonuses depending on their role. Attackers gain crit damage up and offense up for two turns. Tanks gain crit hit immunity and taunt for two turns. And then the support or healers gain evasion up and speed up for two turns. So, I mean, they ain't bad per se. It's just, would I use it? No, because... No, I just wouldn't. I have no reason to, honestly. Like, I'm just like, I don't really need it. No, Necron, no. Get those get those bad thoughts out of your brain. No, we're not doing solos here. I mean, I could because it's a busted uh, Qui-Gon team, but you know. No, no. We're going, f we're going full throttle. Going full send. We're not going to leave any... Any, uh... Anyone alive. No mercy. No prisoners. No prisoners. Now for you. 
probably could just auto this, honestly. <laughs> I probably just could have autoed it the entire time. I don't know if you didn't realize, like, Jihani's not a old, like, a Galactic Republic Jedi or what, but, uh, imagine you losing by three banners now. Wow. I still have fleets to clear, though, and, yeah. Come on now. Okay. Executor. Okay, what else is on defense? Profundity and Negotiator. Okie dokie then. Um. Well, that makes my life really fucking easy. I'm gonna do some Leviathan shenanigans. Where am I, Sith? Um, we'll take these. We could, uh, we'll take that. Uh. I don't really need a palp mobile. Watch, as soon as I say that, I'm gonna need it. Is it possible to win? Yes, it is, Thom, because he dropped four fights in the south front zone. He dropped a fleet battle, and I dropped Uno fight across the entire board. So, yes. It is very much in the cards. Wow, thank you for your kind words of wisdom there, Thom. It's not like I do this fight every day in Fleet Arena. No, I don't know how to run the Sith Empire at all. No siree. I do because I run this damn thing daily. Yes, very cool. Thank you for not hitting the taunting tank. I'm gonna bring the scimitar so that way we can hide. Malgus. Because you know why? Fuck you is why, game. One of the many flaws of this fleet. In my opinion, you know. I don't mind if ships can get their taunts stripped, but the fact that he constantly has his kind of throws a whole wrench in the plan of like, ah, yes, taunting tanks. But yours? No, yours doesn't get a taunt. No, fuck you. That's why. But the enemy's capital- the enemy's tank? Yes, taunting all the time. All the- all the time. I don't know why I did the bombing run there, but whatever. I'm gonna lose Scimitar in a second. Maybe. Alright, let's call in you. I'm gonna get rid of you. Uh, okay. You don't think Profundity is running away with my fleet? You don't say! <laughs> you don't say! I run this fleet every day. Uh, I don't think we can, Necron, honestly. I haven't tested it, and I have no idea. I know it's on CG's radar, but that means diddly squat, because ever since they said that, like, oh, we're aware of the bugs with this fleet, they haven't done anything to fix it. So... It may still work, it may not still work. Or they may have silently fixed it without telling anyone. I don't know. <laughs> That's a good question, but... Uh, yeah, I don't know. Uh, I mean, I don't blame you, Michael, for throwing it on defense. Especially if you do, like, like all three, like, the big... Like, the GL ships, like, Executor, Leviathan, and Profundity. It may work out for you. It's just, I don't... Considering how far I plummet daily in Fleet Arena with this fleet, I know how easily it is to beat. So I'm just, I am keep it for offense. It's not the best banners, obviously, but you know. Yeah. Alright. Now for some profundity love, because he did the stupid triple attacker lineup, thinking I would be gerbated by that, I guess, or tripped up. I don't fucking know what he was thinking, but... Uh, here we go. <clears throat> Alright. Yeah. 
There you go, Kyle. At least you got you're getting funding next month. That's one GL ship down, and you'll be quite happy. Oh yeah, I'm completely aware of how badly Triple's hacker lineups can uh, ruin my day with the resistance, not resistance, the uh, rebel fleet. Ah, so you barely missed it because of relic levels. Well, how many more relics and levels do you need, Kyle? He's hopefully. You're not too far off. And if you're saying you're going to be ready next month, I'd imagine you really aren't that far off to begin with, so. Hey, you got to get the executor sometime, Necron. <laughs> yeah, Fleet RNG is the absolute bane of everyone's existence. It is... Yeah, Jabba, Ray, and Lord Vader can ruin your day, but fleets, if you can't win on fleets, it just makes your day so much more worse, man. It is the kryptonite of a lot of players, just because of how stupid it is. Alright, now for fun of the bounty hunters. Two on Jin. Oh, okay, so you're almost there. Oh, you just have, like, the relic. Aren't they relic five Rex? Yeah, because Cassian was the relicate wreck. So you're almost there. Yeah, you'll definitely be ready. Alright. Uh, of course. <sighs> Good lord. Ah. The everlasting fun of farming relic mats. Or the fragments for, uh... The characters, or, like, the ships? What are you... I'm not sure what you're farming still. Like... Um... Yeah, why not? At least we get to maybe see a seismic charge from Boba in a second. I hope. It's always fun watching that. Ah, single data. Yeah, okay. That's what I thought you meant, but I was just trying to make sure before I really commented. But yeah, if you only need relic mats, then yeah. Oh yeah. Relic. Relic. Uh, R7. R7. God damn. Seven star on uh, Razor Crest has tripped up a lot of people, especially... If uh, you've been gone for a while or you weren't playing and all that fun jazz, it's just a mess. Alright, let's see what the final damage is for this poor man. I mean, it's a win for me, but you know. 1806. I'll take it. I cannot complain. That was... Yeah, I'll take it. Especially after my mess up against the last opponent. It is what it is, but yeah. I don't know if everyone saw earlier, or if you weren't here at the beginning. Uh, he dropped a lot of fights on the south zone, so... And also, the interesting thing with this, um... With my Malgus team here, was that he had killed everyone but Bastila. So... Yeah, I don't really know... Ah, yeah, Hoarding Crystals. Hoarding is the way to go for crystals, especially if you need them for lots of things. But yeah, uh, I can show you all the uh, Kron that I have with that Malgus team. Like I said, I'm, that's why I'm like jealous of a lot of y'all's defense rolls. Like, my best is 172% defense. Like, that's the highest that I, ever, I got. Like, I've tried, I tried getting rid of the health, I tried getting rid of the crit damage. It's gonna succeed. And I've tried on a lot of them, but I just... Didn't do as well as y'all did. I mean, my Jabacron has 138, so... Yeah, I mean... 
Yeah, you need about 23, 24,000 to get it. To get it day one. Or like in one go, I should say. Like if you're going for getting the capital, like the executor uh, Leviathan and Perfoni on one day, it's probably about 24,000-ish crystals, if I remember correctly. So. But yeah, let's see where I am in Fleet Arena. 14th, like I said. <laughs> um, Leviathan does not hold well defensively because, yeah, Perfoni just steamrolls it. You get 19 tries per bonus uh, tier. They like every go around every month. So, yeah. And like I do have other people that have Leviathan on defense, but they obviously get it ignored. So that people can hit me if I'm in the way. You know, it's fine. It is what it is. I don't really care. But yeah, that's going to wrap it up, really. I mean, I'm glad I knocked that out real easily. Now I can just do whatever else for the rest of the day. Worry about territory war. I need to finish off the uh, Tuscan GC. I got like half of it done. So, but yeah. Um, I don't know when I will be streaming later on this week for the start of a uh, week three. Let me look at something real quick. Um. Oh. I'll probably end up streaming, um, on Wednesday night, like right at the start of a Grand Arena. I don't know, I haven't made up my mind on it yet, but it'll probably be Wednesday that I do it, but I'll let everyone know whenever I get the stream set and all that fun stuff, but yeah. I'm trying to, just that. Yeah, thanks everyone for, uh, you know, showing up. I hope y'all had... Fun. I didn't realize Tom was in Discord with me the entire time. Wow. But yeah. Michael says he's a 375%. But yeah. I'll see you guys later. Hope y'all have a good rest of your Monday. And I'll catch you in a couple days.